you are still watching ways the united nations general assembly declared may 3rd to be world press freedom day or just world press day observed to raise awareness of the importance of freedom of the press and remind governments of their duty to respect and uphold the rights to freedom of expression enshrined under article 19 of the 1948 universal declaration of human rights and marking the anniversary of the windec declaration a statement of free press principles put together by african newspaper journalists in windec in 1991. imagine what the i mean I, I i can't even imagine what journalism would be like without the press or how the world would even be <laughs> without the press because how do you want to know what is going on how do you want to you know stay in touch how why are you smiling like that they had, I, I think they had the town carers are still there really still they, I, but you know we can actually consider them the yeah, olden days yes press now. i mean that's what they of press, were you ever in press club no never okay. i didn't like all this kind of things <laughs> and here you are today here you are only if you knew well i was i've always i've always liked things that have to do with oratory my oratory skills and things like that yeah so in secondary I, school, I, I, I could school. never have guessed that i had a knack for it for, it, yeah. for me it was just i, I liked maths because it's just straightforward follow the formula it's actually well you see all this literature you know you actually have to think and mm. put in your mm. own i'm just like nah <laughs> It's not really my thing. But hey, we are here, notwithstanding. All right, Mary, what do you find for us in the news today? Okay, um, I would like for them to pull up a video of a very, very lucky sheriff, mm. policeman, who was, um, he stopped a car and was conducting a check and another car, you know, rammed. He was able to see it quickly and... No, we have to play it again. And I was like, wow, saved huh. by a set. Like, you oh, literally yes, watch yeah. your life flash through your eyes. I mean, but we're grateful to God for life. So, I know, right? yeah, that's huh. what I found. In the I've seen an accident like that before where there was this oncoming trailer. I don't know if you're familiar with that Ido Road coming from the mainland. Mm. And I do, sometimes I don't know why they do that. Some guys drive one, one way. way. Yeah. yeah. And <laughs> a trailer was coming and this guy was like in my oh head my i had seen the accident happen <laughs> i had it had happened already in my imaginations right <laughs> and i just saw the guy swerve and he hit the um, um, pig. i was like i literally had to stop the car so i'm like oh, that was close huh. crazy god save us okay so um two things that caught my attention in the news today the first one was this story of Iyanya where <laughs> he found this lady at davido's concert and mm. he decided to invite the lady uh, i you think they've gone out for dinner hey but yeah they went out for dinner but now Iyanya has come out to say that um he shared some pictures from their dates and he said, you all remember how he started two Sundays ago when I cited an amazing girl at Davido's Timeless concert. She was eyeing me throughout my performance. I couldn't forget her beautiful smile. And I tweeted about it. Luckily, Florence reached out. I said her picture. I asked my team to reach out to her. Blah, 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 blah. And then he said his team contacted her. They made plans for her to come to Lagos. And um, he said life is too short not to spread kindness. He said he meant no harm whatsoever. And he put out a disclaimer saying that... Um, when he came back, he went to Silver Jetty and spent the afternoon with her on a boat cruise. He said she's amazing. And he talked about how she has dreams of becoming an influencer and how he got her an iPhone just to, you know, encourage her and, you know, on her influencing journey. He said, I did not bring her here for any other agenda, but just to make sure that she was happy after all that she's been through. And I think that was a very kind gesture for yeah, me. And I really hope that. From the crowd. Right? When is your time? Well, what's not doing as the girl was I know. <laughs> and even if she was really that's okay that's completely fine yeah and then the second one i've seen a lot of people talk about um the zenith 
um, Zenith apps not working today. And some, some a post that was put up by Tech Cabal said there was a fire incident actually on yeah, Adjusted this adjusted. morning. And it says that it has affected the primary data center, which is now causing a network Glitch. downtime. Yeah, okay. so I've seen a lot of people tweeting and abusing Zenith Bank again, saying that they have started with their bank problems. But guys, calm down. They had a fire incident and that's, it has affected their data network and that's why they're having a network downtime as it is. So we might want to just, you know, cut them some slack. For to once. be fair, yes. I mean, Zenith is, is, is pretty okay. Mm. A few times when, like, the Naira Scasti, when they had the, you know, glitch. But aside from any major <laughs> issue... I've yeah, not really, I've right. not really, to be honest, or me personally, I'll be honest, I don't think I've had that much issues with I feel like you don't work on weekends, like the cat stops working from Friday <laughs> and then starts working on Monday again. But yeah, that's not what we're talking about. So we're talking about the hearts. And I we're just corrected the that, the hearts, the heart, okay. that the heart was actually formed. Oh, yes, it does red, right? <laughs> <laughs> that yeah. um, the heart is actually from from the womb, so it's not even from when you are giving me from the wow. from the womb, right from the very beginning. The heart is there, mm. and that's why we can't wait to actually talk about the healthy heart, how to keep your heart healthy. But then, before we continue the conversation, let's go on a break. See you after the break. <laughs> 